Wrote that article, and she's a reporter for Axios Media and joins us right now. So the article is really good because it really sort of like ticks off time after time after time that we have consumed or be ex been exposed to inaccurate information. Um, the internet was supposed to make us, you know, more savvy, right? How did we get to this point? And what's driving this spread of misinformation, especially now that we've, you know, for the last few years have been talking a lot about, you know, guarding against misinformation and it doesn't seem to be making a difference. And they're creating opportunities to deceive people, whether that's creating fake news or creating botnets to spread fake news. And as you mentioned, it's causing a lot of confusion. People don't know if the videos that they're watching are real, if the voices and audio that they're listening to has been doctored. And quite frankly, no one knows what's going to come next in 2020. safety.
how this misinformation has reshaped our society. And you talk about, you know, very specific things, you know, driving the news. Um, so we are finding that real crises are occurring in the real world because of fake news. We ask, what do we do about it? Like, we can't just let the world function this way. A lot of governing bodies around the world power of fake influence. Oh, <laughs>